My name is Dr. Anise Mikhail. I'm an attending spine surgeon. I'm going to be talking today about various spinal conditions, starting with the anatomy of the spine. The spinal column is formed of bony blocks we call them vertebrae. These vertebrae are connected together by this, which are cushions. These are the shock absorbers. These vertebrae are also connected in the back by joints. These are the facet joints. They're one on each side. Inside the spinal column is the spinal canal. This canal runs from the skull all the way to the tailbone. In the cervical spine, which is the spine in the neck, lives the spinal cord. In the thoracic spine, or around the chest area, is also the spinal cord. And then in the lumbar spine, which is the lower back, the spine houses the nerve roots that go down to the lower extremity. Spinal conditions affect the spinal column by affecting the integrity of the spinal column and it can cause neck pain or back pain. Also other spinal conditions can affect the nerves or the spinal cord by causing impingement on the spinal cord and the nerves and that can cause neurologic manifestations including pain, numbness, tingling, difficulty walking, as well as bowel bladder control problems.